Okay, as requested, we are looking at Homer Simpson. So before I do get in the video, if you guys do enjoy the video uh, and would like to support the channel, I'd really appreciate it. If you could leave like thumbs up, uh, comments up, all that fun stuff really helps the channel. And wow, I really just stumbled all my words. Anyway, just getting into it. Uh, what we are necessarily looking at right here is you do potentially have a wedge forming if I were to guess. Um, which, if that is the case then, we are on the four hour time frame. I do want to switch over to the one hour. So I'm going to go a bit back and forth between the time frames. Just uh, talk about a couple of things here. So should you end up coming back on up? I'd anticipate that you probably end up finding resistance right around right around here so i mean like this could go higher but uh well we don't have really any other touch point so could end up being like that and then this one ends up being a little steeper um either way so let's say we don't and we end up just going up to roughly right around there that even looks fine uh you would be fine however i do think that there's still a chance that you do actually end up making uh, another low that actually lines up with 382 quite nicely or 618 whatever you want to call it um so yeah if anything what i could potentially anticipate right now is that you do end up coming back on up then come back down and you're either going to make a higher low or you're going to make one more new lower low and if you were to do so, I'd be essentially looking for either one of these two boxes that we have going on over here. Now, you may be wondering as to why. Um, oops. I don't necessarily think that um, you will make like a significantly like newer low. Like I said, I, I think you have a possible chance that you end up making a like wedge right here, which if that's the case, then uh, you pretty much come up, get rejected, come back down one more time and then from there you should end up breaking out which if we zoom out a little bit right here what you guys can also see is so we do have this one fib from the high down to this low over here 618 rejection quite nice uh 50 didn't exactly get but 382 100 even got that one and if we are looking back towards the downside right here, you can see our th other 382 is roughly at about however many zeros, 28 or 29 flat, we'll say. It's at 28.59, but um, yada, yada, yada. Actually, I could fix that a little bit. There we are. 382 is actually at about 10.81. But anyway, that being said, um, these boxes down here should you actually end up coming down to them we have i'll label like four areas essentially so the high end of the first box is at however many zeros 2642 low end is at 23 flat then high end uh lower box is 1452 and low end is at 11 or 1115 um outside of that you can also kind of see just even at the bottom right here not necessarily that you see the color difference but if we do try and zoom in over here and if we were you know this might be easier on the four hour so if we were to compare just what we can see right now uh you did even make this low over here you had higher volume clearly that ended up pushing us up then we did just come all the way back down and we made a newer low but you can see clearly that was on significantly lower volume which is a bullish sign so assuming if we were to get said rejection and come back down and make another new low and it's equally as low if not lower with the volume then that would be a increasingly um bullish sign and showing is essentially that you more likely not would have like a triple tap one two and then one more for three and you end up moving back on up which if you were to well i can't necessarily take a measured move because we don't have a second price point to go off of yet because i don't think this is necessarily done so i do think in the short term it does continue moving up but do you think it will get rejected doesn't get rejected roughly right over here 
You could even come up, but you shouldn't necessarily break past this prior high. And if you were to get past there, then the other area that I would actually look at would be... Do you want to switch over to this? Uh, I think you'd be looking for roughly right around here. That's uh, between 1351 and 1281. So other than that, I know this is financial advice. These are all just my thoughts and opinions. And you guys have a phenomenal day as always. Adios, muchachos.